Hello people of YouTube, welcome back to another video where today we're going to be doing a oil change on this 18 horse Intec Briggs with the oil filter. First thing you want to do is run the engine for a few minutes and get that oil nice and hot. Then you're going to drain the oil. If you still have the deck on your lawnmower, then you're probably going to need a piece of pipe or some kind of rubber hose to come out from the uh, drain plug out to your drain pan. If you don't have a drain pan, then you can just get some something big enough that will hold all the oil and it won't leak all over the place. doesn't have to be a drain pan. Now what you're going to do, you can come side your engine here, pull this little cap off the drain plug. Sometimes you might need a pair of pliers. Twist it and pull it out. Here comes the oil. And to make it go along a little faster, you can bring the dipstick out. And that will help it drain a little faster. Alright, so once it's done draining, you can go ahead, push it in, turn it back, cap back on. Okay, so now we're going to take the oil filter off. I've got a uh, oil filter wrench but if you have a bigger big pair of channel locks that will fit on there you can do that as well this is where it's it really messy Usually. Yep. Okay, so now we're going to take our new oil filter. Make sure it looks the same. It's about right. Wrapping off. Now, we're going to take our straight 30 oil. We're going to put a little bit in it. Get all the elements, prime it. Roll around. Make sure you get everything nice and oily inside. And you're gonna take a little bit of oil and rub it around this rubber gasket. Go ahead. I'm gonna screw it back on. Now you're going to take a paper towel, wipe it off. Hands off. Get it a little tighter. As tight as you can by hand. Everything around it. So you want to fill the oil up to 
to between between those two holes right there and at the bottom of the screen here I'll put how many ounces that is those numbers are for this what this engine is rated for make sure you look up what uh, how much oil your engine takes right now you're gonna grab your funnel make sure there's no particles in it no grass nothing uh nothing that can get in the oil now we're gonna go ahead fill the oil up Well, yeah. Wouldn't be an oil change if I weren't spilling anything. Or dropping something. quite close but no cigar See there, right between two lines. Make sure you check it before every mowing use or use period, and make sure that the uh, got the oil filter tight and it's not leaking under there. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.